Hello everyone, it's me again, GW Fan the Softcore Brony, welcome you back to Let's Play Cutie My Crusader Warriors. So, there's not bosses at the end of these, more like mini bosses, because each one has a collection of enemies that we otherwise fight as random encounters, and I'm gonna go ahead and do them. Because there actually is a pretty good reward for them. I This one over here is the easiest one. We go through very short paths. I mean, they're not even anything significant to get to these. So, yeah, there's the boss, so to speak. I don't know why, but for some reason, this room is called Ninth Trial. None of the other rooms are referred to as trials. So... Uh, I don't know. <laughs> anyway, uh, I guess I maybe should show off my stats finally for once. I haven't done that for a while. Yeah, Sweetie Belle is catching up to Apple Limp's speed quick. <laughs> so, Scootaloo is already far surpassed. Like, even the, well, the Paladin even. Like, she's already seven above, and she still needs four more levels to catch up. So, yeah, she's well on her way to being obscene, as it were, so, anywho, uh, I guess not, as we take on four gamblers, they're still not very dangerous, I still don't know what they do after they charge up, because they'll charge up for, like, a second turn, even, so, okay, uh, I don't really have, I mean, I don't really have much of a purpose in actually weakening them, <laughs> much, so I'm just gonna go ahead and do, like, D-Faithra and D, uh, D, or not D-Faithra, uh, D-Shell-Ra. No, Shell-Ga, sorry. It's like, what the heck? <laughs> yeah, Faraja, and go ahead and do Dragon Breath just because I can. Boom. Yeah, they're... Oh. Well, fine then, jerks! I guess I can't do that. It's not like Apple Bloom really contributes much to this fight anyway, because they're all practically dead as it is, so... Uh, okay, I guess I could have done Dia, and that would have worked out a little bit better, but whatever. Okay, that, Faraja, you attack that one, and yeah, we'll kill at least one of them. I could have killed two of them, but... No, I thought I could actually weaken their defenses, but I didn't do enough testing to find out, so... Oh, is that what you do? Oh, that's neat. I don't really care, though. Really? Wow, which one of you has the least amount of HP? You? Okay, Faraja. Jerks. The whole lot of you. I oh, got a little bit from that, and also our stat, or er, stats, whatever, HP restored, so awesome. We can get into random encounters in this room, I think. And there's also actually a new enemy we can meet in the various random encounter, or is there a random encounter now? I don't think we could have met it previously, but... Ooh, button! What does this button do? Actually, not what you would think. Why do I say that? Because, well, for some reason, the lower right path ignites the upper right flame, and the upper right path ignites the lower right flame, so they both lead to the wrong buttons for some reason, but whatever. Anyway, let's see. Next easiest, actually, arguably, is upper right, but I'm going to go ahead and do this one anyway. I mean, the last three actually are kind of hard in their own right. Yeah, there are random encounters in that room, but we got another boss, and we have a path up there. We can't actually go there yet. Yeah, this is T7R2, so I guess it's supposed to be Trial 7, but the fact that it just uses a different name... Um. <laughs> anyway, this is a little bit more dangerous. Because we fight two sacrifices, which... The reason this is dangerous is because they, you know, they have that weird kill status effect thing. And they could potentially get it on two of us. 
and they are capable of using multi-target Eroja, so that sucks. <laughs> now anyway, right from the start, we're not going to be killing them in one turn, no matter what we do, because they just have that much HP, so I might as well uh, beat them down a little bit. I mean, I could use Luna on them, I suppose. That could certainly prevent them from using that kill ability, but they're using their Soul Steel. But to use it this turn, yeah, that was the other reason, because they have that move, and I didn't want to get the slow. Let's see. Hmm. Not a whole lot I can do about that, so let's just do this. I don't think I'm going to be killing him this turn either, unfortunately. What happened? Is that Soul Steel already? It was gone already? It didn't even last for one turn? Did it miss? Well, she's dead. Ow. Yeah, I've had them kill two characters with that before, so let's do that. Let's see, you're going to die. Well, actually, no, you're not going to die, unfortunately. Mm. Going to come close, though. Welcome back, Scoot. Uh-oh. Ow. Or not. I would try to heal myself, but I could end up dying this turn anyway, so I won't. Uh, yeah, Faraja will do, and you attack that guy. Yeah, I knew I wasn't gonna make it, but... Gotta... Oh, yeah, they can do the death spell anyway. Not that... Wow, you guys suck today. All right, Sweetie Belle gets a level up. Gets a little bit closer to that next magic, which I'm unfortunately not going to make before I uh, get to the final boss there, but. And we're healed, yay. Yeah, now this path opens up and we get to go up uh, another super long flight of stairs. Kind of like the background though. Looks nice. I'm surprised, there we go, I was going to say, yeah, there's the other new enemy, Rejection, she's actually one of the mini-bosses, too, along with, actually, Sacrifice and two other got characters that were, I'm going to do that one last, just because there's a little something extra we have to do afterwards in that one, it's not really the hardest of the, of the four rooms, I think the next one is that I'm going to be doing, personally. Yeah, that one does the correct flame there, but yeah, I'm going to go ahead and do this one next. And same thing, there are random encounters in here. Yeah, there's sacrifice times two as a random encounter, so it's kind of weird that it's a, one of the mandatory bosses, but okay. Yeah, T6R2. Why can't you just be trial s yeah, 6 or trial 7 or whatever? Why is the R2 and everything there? Anyway. Yeah, you're right. This one actually is somewhat challenging. For much the same reason as the last one, except that, yeah, Sacrifice and the Ultimate Giant are here. So I can't kill either one of them very quickly, unfortunately. So let's see. First thing I want to do, let's go ahead... And get the Grape Ga going with Viraja and Dragon Breath. Because the Giant, I want you just mostly neuter as it is. I mean, I can't neuter it too much because it still does quite a bit of damage, but... Thank you for not hitting. Yeah, that sucks. Because now he could actually hit multiple characters too. How did you not kill Apple Bloom? Huh. Okay. I don't know what happened there, but it did. Yeah. I could still get killed though. Huh. Yeah, I would rather prioritize that than healing Apple Blim since she still could get one shot. By the way, if they if you're under Soul Steel and they hit you with Soul Steel, that will not kill you. So, that's nice. Okay, now I can stand to heal Apple Bloom a bit. So, yeah, let's 
else. How do you do it to yourself there? Do that, and you are not quite as close as I might like, but I don't, yeah, I don't think I'm going to quite kill you this turn. But I'll come pretty darn close if not. So, nice. You know, you could have just hit her. You didn't have to go through the freaking death spell, which I'm surprised you missed twice in a row. Yeah, I'm right there. Okay. Yeah, definitely want to go after Sacrifice next. Let's go for eight for Raja, and yeah, Sacrifice. Screw you, Sacrifice. I might actually kill both of you this turn, huh? Sweet. Well, am I? No, I think I'm just short on you. Yeah, I thought so. Good thing nothing attacks Apple Bloom, despite all the defense I put into her. Sheesh. Yeah, I thought so. Okay. Uh, yeah, let's go get Kiraja, and this fight's pretty much over. Hit that ultimate giant. It's not so ultimate. That jerk's handled. And Panga, because why the heck not? Well, that sucks for... <sighs> okay. How close are you to dying? I'll get you close enough, even if I don't use Quick on Scootaloo, because I'm going to have to take a turn to get you up anyway, so... I don't even really need the Kiraja. I really can't do enough damage to... Like, even now. <laughs> really can't do enough damage to kill anyone in one turn for the most part. Let's see, it's just... Should be it? Yeah, I should be able to get him. I don't care. Or not. How close did I get? I was expecting a little bit more damage than that, Apple Bloom. Anyway. At least he doesn't give himself speed whenever he boosts himself like that. He might be a little bit more ultimate then. Yay! Well, a little bit more speed. Getting closer to that 255 special defense. Ooh, speaking of defenses. Let's get that uh, defense crystal to you and spirit crystal to you. How close are you? Oh, you're at 194. Oh, you're so close to 200 on defense there. Hmm, nice. Anywho, another flight of stairs. Because why not, I guess? Yeah, there's you two now. Yeah. I don't think that last fight we fought can actually be a random encounter, at least as far as I've seen so far. Oh yeah, gamblers are in groups of three now. So, there's that. I haven't seen any chimeras trying to climb around here, though. Seems like that enemy kind of disappeared or something. I don't know. Something activated. All right, the proper flame lit up. Oh yeah, supply crystal right there if you absolutely need it, but I don't. Well, what am I sitting here for? <laughs> Force of habit? I don't know. Anyway, this one's a little bit more complicated, if only because of that angel enemy that's gonna be in it, because she can cast the mind spell, which is mildly annoying. So yeah, T. Is that TB? Oh, I thought it was T. Okay, T8R2. Why can't you just be trial 8? Where's the consistency? I don't know. It's because there's a nice reward at the end of it. That's why. That's sort of true. Eh. Since the gamblers have very little HP, well, actually, I should go for the spirit, because it's not like he has that, well, he actually does. The gamblers have very little HP, so, yeah, let's see, let's go for the Faith Ra this time, or not, not, not Ra, Ga, excuse me, and let's see, Faraja, and Dragon Breath as always. Helps a little bit, at least keeps them slowed down if she decides to use mine this turn. 
Of course, there's always that. And there's always that. That sucks. Well, at least they didn't hit Scootaloo. Cherry, Cherry, and you don't care, so I could, let's see, can I kill you? I can, I, well, I might, I'm not guaranteed though. I'll try. Nope, just short. How short? Yeah, there's mine. That's annoying. That's why I wanted to slow them down. I'll do it again this turn now. Don't hit. I'm surprised. You're... Oh, there's something else you can do. That would have killed her. Or actually, would it? No, I think that kill thing actually still would have activated. 398. Yeesh. All right. Arise, Scootaloo. You are still needed. Yeah, so the gamblers actually can do some annoying things, except I didn't really get to see... Oh. Okay, that's actually not that bad at all. Kiracha, because why the heck not? Kiracha! You're right there. Yeah, let's go ahead and do another Dragon Breath, since that will kill the gambler regardless. That will slow them down again in case he decides to be mine again. You and your freaking kill site! She mostly does, like, stat debuffs, I've noticed. Hmm. I could kind of kill either one of you. Might as well, I'm going to get healed anyway, so... Stick out spirit, and you're toast, lady. After we get those stats back. Overkill! After we get those stats back. Huzzah! Scootaloo gets her, well, what will be the final level, before the final boss at least, anyway. I'll still be doing a bit of level grinding for the super bosses, although it's not quite as necessary. Anyway, we're not done with this trial yet, because there's a, not a maze, but just a little meandering path here. It looks like a maze offhand, but this right here is the only, uh, well, path we can choose from that has a split in it, so Cupcake and Muffin, I already have more than enough of those, and yeah, we can meet, well, her and other stuff again, so yeah, otherwise, it's just a straight shot that isn't quite so straight because, well, once again, the path is designed to force us to get into as many random encounters as possible. Oh, we can get, fight two of her. Boy, imagine if both of them used mine, that would be annoying. Except they don't really seem to attack much. They're primarily status debuffs. It's kind of weird. Yeah, there's you again. Yeah, I haven't seen the Chimera at all so far. Or that... That Grim Reaper thing. Whatever that was. In this area, these areas. So, I don't know if you can actually meet them. They've apparently been replaced by Rejection there. Big green button. Awesome. Something's activated. And what do we get for our prize? Actually, a pretty good reward, honestly. We get a special supply crystal. Which has apple pie, apple cider, and all of the freaking crystals that we can freaking buy. I, I could buy more of these, but I don't especially care. <laughs> uh, let's see. I do want to get yeah, a couple of things there. Let's see. I need eight more for Apple Bloom. Let's go ahead and buy ten of those just because I can. I want to buy twenty more of those. I want to buy ten more of those. And ten more of those. And I don't know, what else, maybe. Let's see, then. Let's see, this will finish off my HP. I could get higher than that, but I'll be getting higher than that eventually anyway. Get that, just because it gets her to an even number as a... Uh, 
flank flank, because why not? Now let's see, you're at 194, so okay, you need six of those. I'll be at 200. And I might as well give some to the Scoot, because she gets targeted so much. Lots of mana, because why the heck not? Get that speed there, because you are so falling behind. And Crystal Luck, because why the heck not? That is kind of important for you. That is one of your main functions. So speed of 171 versus 152. Not bad, not bad. 152, huh? Hmm. I could use, like... You know what? Yeah, let's make that a little bit more even. Get just... Five more of those, and... It was three more I need there, right? Yeah. Not quit, not after all that work. <laughs> yeah, let's go ahead and get three more for you and two more for you, and that will be just a little nicer. 155 and 173. Okay, so that wasn't quite as even as I thought, but whatever. I didn't realize that was quite the number you were at, but that will be good enough, so... Yeah, stats are looking pretty good there. I can get some free healing. I can buy more crystals later if I really want it. And we can take on the final boss in the finale of Let's Play Cutie My Crusader Warrior. So there still will be super bosses afterwards. So we're far from over, viewers. <laughs> Arrivederci!